welcome back to more Let's Play Zelda Ocarina of Time Randomizer. In the previous episode, we did delved through the Gerudo Fortress, and uh, were able to save the four carpenters. Um, other than that, I don't think we got a major item. It's been a couple days since I was last able to play. Um, which, by the by, today is the first of 2022, so... Happy New Year, everyone. Not that this will be released anytime near this date, but I don't know, we'll see. But we did uh, infiltrate the lovely Gerudo Fortress, so there are a few things that we can go ahead and do while we're here. Uh, first of all being, we'll probably want to call Epona and do the archery game. As much as I hate to say it, it potentially could have a really good prize. So we'll start off with that. Um, we do have the Megaton Hammer. Is it is it called the Megaton Hammer? Yeah, okay. I was about to say, for whatever reason, every single time I say Megaton, I just think of Fallout 3. So I'm just sitting there like, ugh, maybe not. <laughs> Oh yeah, you have to talk to her while on the floor. Oh, come on, this is garbage. My archery skills are gross. Well, I got closer, I guess. Ah, that one was really close. We got at least the a thousand one this time. Yep, there we go, there's a thousand. Thousand two hundred and sixty. Not bad, not bad. Kidding me? We got a fool. Great. So that was the a thousand. Now we gotta get a thousand one hundred or five hundred. Ah, that one's gonna be tough. God dang it! It's the closest I've made it.
Oh, I got it. Okay, cool, cool. Please be something good. Okay, well, ice arrows aren't necessarily great, but it's something. It's better than a fool or some rupees, I suppose. Alright, so with that one done, I think... No, I don't think I could teleport. We're gonna try and teleport to uh, the fire temple, but I get the feeling that there's a good chance I can't get back up from the bottom. Because I don't have the hook shot yet. So there's a good chance I can't get back up to the bottom. We're gonna try though. Yeah, I didn't think so. Alright, um... I suppose the next best... We'll do this, and then use the Lost Woods Warp to get to, uh, Death Mountain Crater. Man, until I get the hook shot or the long shot, this, this run is getting real slow. Hell, even if I could get the boomerang, things would speed up a little bit, because I at least could do it out of dungeons. Thank you very much for your rupees. Not that I'm not giving them all the time anyway, but I can still appreciate it. <laughs> eh, I'll get two just in case. Who knows? I do need to figure out where I can get some bugs so I can start doing some of those, uh, scarabs in the, in the pot soil. That would be a good idea. Speaking no, uh, I'm only at 23, it looks. I was about to say, speaking of, how many do I need before I get round number three? I'm gonna be so mad, honestly, if the golden skulltulas are blocking off, uh, my progression. Because there is a really good chance that they are, though. Oh, god. Dang it. I forgot. Frickin' Mito. You can't get past them without Serena's frickin' song. I swear. Okay, okay, okay. I guess now that I have the silver gauntlets, though, I could potentially go through this route. Couldn't I? Because this should lead straight to Death Mountain. Crater. Just a different entrance. Yeah, this just leads me to the top portion of this. Cool, cool, cool. Hmm, I don't think either of these guys have anything for me. No. Alright, well there is a couple things that we can do here. First of all, if I remember it, this is the Great Fairy. Maybe she has something good for us. We can hope. Well, 
Well, I won't... I won't deny it. That's okay, I guess. It's a lot better than half the crap that I've been getting from Great Fairies, so... Uh, that'll at least save me farming 200 rupees to do the Water Temple if I have to do that one. Right. You know, do... No, I think I need the hook shot in order to do the fire temple, don't I? I can't remember. Did I ever end up dropping down here and getting whatever the heck was down here? I don't see it on my list of to-dos, but I'll, I'll look anyway. Yeah, I did, okay. I can't remember what I got from there, but fair enough. Alright, so what we can do, I can become a kid again real quick, uh, come back, and um, come all the way up here, because I can get a couple golden skulltulas, and if I set the uh, soil down real quick, I can actually... Go ahead and uh, get the defense magic. So that would be a pretty good start. Alright, alright, alright. To be fair, I might need to start doing some dungeons. I know I don't really have access to any, but uh... If I could start doing a couple dungeons here and there, I might start getting some of those, like, spiritual stones so that I could, like, learn the Song of Time and what have you. Because I could really use getting Saria Song, but I, unfortunately I just, I don't think I'm gonna get it until I, I trigger the cutscene to where Link gets the, uh, Ocarina of Time. Which will suck. I'm gonna farm some rupees real quick, though. Okay, so first of all, I want to come over this way and climb up Death Mountain. Actually, 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 actually. There should be a bomb spot over here, if I remember right. I want to get a couple bugs for that potting soil. If I remember right, a lot of these underground bits have at the bugs. Not here, though. Good for me. Chose the one damn spot that didn't have any bugs. Uh... I do think, actually, there is a... Owl dungeon. There might be one up there. There's like a... Cow Grotto up there. I wanted to smack into the tree, sir. That was rude. 
And I suppose I can take another glance at the uh, bottom of the well and see if I can't uh, finish that up. Because for whatever reason, I couldn't find all the, the keys. There's definitely more to that dungeon. I just don't know why I wasn't able to find it. No bugs here. Get out of my way. spot in here. I think there should be bugs in that. Are there really no bugs in here? Where the heck do you find bugs? That actually does give me bugs. That is extremely rude. Game, really. Well, at the very least, I guess I could plant the the bee over here. I am not gonna lose my shield to a bunch of meteorites. Hold on. Considering how many times the game has given me this shield, I'm really not about to lose it. Not that the item I'm prepping to get is the most amazing thing ever, but it does help. And it's better than rupees, I suppose. God dang it. I was hoping. Oh, come on. Quit being so rude. I'm lazy, okay? I don't want to have to kill you. But you forced my hand. Hello, Kabora Gabora. Been a minute since I've seen you. Alright, so first of all, the boom. Um, the boom. You. That'll give us Scarab number 24. Very nice, very nice. Uh, oh. And then we have the bean patch, which is somewhere. Um, hello? Where's this damn thing? Back I gotta reboot the room. Are there bugs in here? Yes, okay, 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 okay. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Collect a couple. Um, sir. There we go. Just barely, too. Is the bean patch? I know there is one. I thought it was up here, though. 
It's just a spiritual stuff. Is it all the way down there? I don't remember it being down there. Reset this real quick, so I have my timer back. Where in the heck is this patch? for the life of me remember where this patch is because it's very well defined in the in the ground usually I do not want to teleport all the way down there just for it not to be there hold on give me just a sec okay yeah it, it's at the very bottom hold on oh wait what am I doing I could just do this First of all, I'll drop a bug in it, because it should give me a gold scarab. Thank you, sir. That puts me at 25, so only five more until uh, we can continue on with that. And then the next thing I need is to plant the magic bee. Alright, fair enough. So, I think that's all I can do down here. I'll have to... The quickest way to get to Hyrule Castle is probably going to be Men in a Forest as well. Unfortunately, I don't have the warp straight to the Temple of Time, which makes this kind of irritating, because I always have to backtrack all the way over there. I like the idea that I still don't have any of those stones currently in this playthrough because I've not been able to do any dungeons. <laughs> and the two dungeons that I have done have given me spirit medallions instead. Or medallions, excuse me. If I can get the hook shot, there's a lot I can do. I just need to get it, and unfortunately, it says it's on that platform, I bet. Over in Lake Halita. Bad it's in Lake Halita. Er, it's on that platform. I guess I could check that out real quick, honestly. So I'll teleport, get this real quick. Or actually, no, that'll give us a good spot to start in the next episode, I think. So... We got the defensive power upgrade. I believe that also finishes up everything I need for this area. Cool, cool. So, theoretically, we could go ahead and start the fire temple. I just, I don't think we can finish it. I wanna say I have to have the hook shot for that dungeon. I know we do for the water temple, so there's, there's no question there. 
But, uh... And the... I'm gonna go ahead and leave it here. And the next... I'll, I'll, I'll walk down a little bit so that I'm not just standing in smoke. In the next episode, I will probably warp over to Lake Halea real quick. See about, uh, what the fire arrow spawn is going to give me. And if it's not the hook shot, I might start the fishing minigame stuff. Or just looking around to see if I can't maybe find out where the hook shot is, because one of the gossip stones definitely gave us the, the hint that the hook shot is in Lake Kalia. So uh, we're, we'll leave this off here, and I'll see you all in the next episode. Well, we're, we're going to go on a hunt for the hook shot. And if, if we can't find it in Lake Kalia right off the bat, I'll probably try and attempt the fire temple as far as we can. So I will see you all then.